hello guys in this video I'm going to tell you how to do a ADF test in Python before we jump into the coding part let me tell you ADF test we do just to check if there is stationarity in the data if a data is stationary in nature it means that it is mean reverting which means that if the price will go up it will come down to mean it will if, if, if the price goes down again it will come revert back to mean so irrespective of the price will go up or it will go down at the end of the day it will come back to mean right so if that is the case then you can develop strategy like mean reverting and all so to know that you have to do ADF test okay so now let's move on to the coding part so here I I have created this Jupyter notebook for you guys this Python the piece of Python code I have done for you guys just to tell you how to do ADF test okay so first I have saved a file a Excel CSV file in my desktop uh, in my desktop okay and then I import that file to this Jupyter notebook so this is this is the coding first you have to import pandas hpd and then df I'm creating a data frame df so then you pd dot read csv so this is the path that where you have saved that file okay now then I just wanted to show you how the file is looks like so this is this is how the file is looking like this is the first five row of the data okay and now you move on to uh, here import matplotlib just to show you how the closing price or how the price is looking like if, if we will at all put into a graph so that's why I, I just run this piece of code and then you can see how the price is looking like so almost it is um, roaming around the mean okay so mean will be here around the here it will go up and down but it is always uh, mean but we need to do a ADF test okay so let's so what you need to do uh, from stash model you have to import ADF fuller ADF fuller right so then then ADF equal to ADF fuller DF the, this uh, this is the column name axis this is the column name right axis so you put that column name here all right and then um, you run this code you will get the the value is 3.1656 okay so the critical value of ADF is uh, you know the probability 99% uh, probability is 3.44 or 3.45 90% probability is 2.57 and 95% probability is 2.87 okay so this is this is this is where I put this data here okay 90% probability is critical value is 2.59 95% is 2.87 and 99% is 3.444 right so here our output uh, our value is 3.16 so 3.165 is less than 2.87 right so here minus 3.165 is less than minus 2.87 so this it, this means that the price is stationary with more than 95% certainty okay this is a very quick quick one uh, how to do a ADF test in uh, Python so I will share this file um, uh, um, uh, with you guys probably that will help you to uh, check this letter and uh, in my next video I'm going to tell you how we can use ADF test to know uh, is there any you know, uh, co-integration between uh, two stocks okay so that can be you know uh, that once you uh, got to know that if, if there is a co-integration then you can develop a uh, strategy like you know pair trading and all right so I'm going to tell you uh, in details how to do a ADF test to check co-integration uh, between two pairs and then how to develop pair trading and all okay so hope you, you have uh, you know uh, you got to know how to do a ADF test uh, in Python through this video. Hope, hope you like this. 
and i will tell you uh, in my next video how to do and uh, how to use adf in different uh, module and all okay till then uh, bye take care